Hello, I'm Crystal Honeycutt, the naturopath with A Step to Health, and I want to talk to you today about three ways the infrared sauna helps to repair your metabolism. So if you are a person who is concerned about your weight, maybe you have a family history of diabetes, maybe your physician or healthcare practitioner has indicated that your metabolism might need support. Considering the infrared sauna as part of your wellness strategy is an awesome opportunity for you as you are about to learn. So when we think about repairing the metabolism, stress is one of the number one things that negatively impacts our metabolism, both in the short term and in the long term. Especially if you have chronic stress in your life, your body responds to that stress by turning down your energy centers. So just think of this like your computer or your phone going into power save mode. Your body does this by turning down the volume on the endocrine glands, especially your thyroid gland, that helps to control your metabolism. This is a survival mechanism, and it makes sense in some ways, but with our modern lives and the kind of stress that all of us live in on a day-to-day -day basis, this can mean that your body turns down your metabolism, and before you know it, the consequences of that are negatively impacting your daily life. This tends to look like weight gain, tiredness, foggy brain, confusion or forgetfulness, um, and a bunch of other negative things that make you feel crummy. So stress is probably the number one thing that impacts the metabolism for the majority of adults. The other thing we want to consider is our exposure to environmental toxins that can negatively impact the mitochondria within our individual cells. The mitochondria within our cells is responsible for producing our cellular energy known as ATP. Environmental toxins can negatively impact our mitochondria's health and its ability to biochemically synthesize ATP. What this means is that you literally just do not have the same amount of energy available to your cells, let alone uh, the, the energy that you use to engage with your day. Uh, so being mindful of environmental toxin exposure and detoxification as the method to help control environmental exposure is really an important consideration when we think about repairing the metabolism. The other thing that we wanna consider is your ability to adapt to your life. So adaptability or resilience is the third factor that we wanna consider in terms of supporting a healthy metabolism. Resilience can be impacted by stress, it can be impacted by environmental toxins, it can be impacted by the quality and amount of sleep you're getting, it can be impacted by your diet and lifestyle, it can also be impacted by your genetics, which is not something that you have a lot of control over. Resilience is your, a body, your body's ability to bounce back and to move forward despite what life throws at you. Now, interestingly, exercise has been shown time and time again to help enhance your natural capacity for resilience. I'm going to talk about how infrared heat mimics the exercise response in the body and helps to tonify your cardiovascular system, your nervous system, your endocrine system, your excretory systems to help support resilience in your body. So when you are relaxing in the sauna and you start to sweat, a lot of important physiological things are taking place. The effects of infrared heat waves actually enhance your core and your skin 
temperature. Your body responds to this by activating the autonomic nervous system, particularly parasympathetic dominance. Now, parasympathetic dominance is really important because it is the opposite of your stress response. We call parasympathetic dominance the rest and digest function of your nervous system. So what research indicates is that while you are resting in the sauna, you are actually activating the components of your nervous system that help your body rest, repair, and work on critical functions that don't happen when you are locked in stress mode. This includes modulating your inflammation, repairing body uh, tissues, and helping to enhance your general well-being. So I like to advise clients to meditate while they're in the sauna, but even if you're not a meditator, you can just be in the sauna and actually be able to activate that parasympathetic dominance naturally the same way meditation and other relaxation methods can support the body's ability to switch out of that chronic stress response and move into the, the system of your body that is responsible for helping to repair and regenerate your body tissues. So infrared sauna helps to support the metabolism by reducing the chronic stress hormones that the majority of us have. It helps to reduce chronic inflammation that um, impairs your ability to have revitalization and just feel better on a daily basis. And it also helps to stimulate the body's recognition that it's actually safe. Remember how I mentioned before that when you are chronically stressed, the body turns down the, the volume knob on your thyroid and other endocrine glands like your adrenal glands to help preserve the body during times of chronic stress? Well, basically the only way to undo that is to prove to your body that it is safe. Spending time in the infrared sauna engages all of the crucial systems of your body that help to remind it that it really is safe. And so it helps to undo the survival mode mechanisms that a lot of our bodies go into for self-preservation. Another thing I really want to talk about here is detoxification. So when I mentioned how environmental chemicals impact your mitochondria's ability to make cellular energy, detoxification is a critical component of helping your system deal with the impact of those toxins. Now, a lot of those toxins get stored in the body because they are dangerous to not only your mitochondria, but to other critical tissues like your brain and your cardiovascular system with your heart. These chemicals get stored in fat molecules. As most women know out there, fat molecules are stubborn. They don't like to break down. So this is an, a pretty good tissue to store dangerous chemicals in because they're very stable. When you're in the environment of the infrared sauna, your body breaks down fat to help mobilize the energy that you need in order to sweat. When these fat cells break down, these dangerous chemicals are temporarily released back into your body. But what is so important to understand here is that while you are actively sweating, those chemicals are not spending time back in your system creating havoc, they are getting excreted through your sweat. So infrared sauna detoxification is a very safe way to detox out harmful chemicals. This has been proven time and time again by scientific research. When we're thinking about resilience, 
Remember how I mentioned exercise as being one of the primary things that helps to enhance resilience? Well, you're going to love this because research has indicated that spending as little as 10 to 15 minutes in the infrared sauna mimics the response of aerobic exercise. This is really fabulous because many of us have impediments to engaging in good quality exercise on a regular basis. No guilt here because we all struggle with it. However, spending time in the infrared sauna actually mimics the cardiovascular response that aerobic exercise affords us. It is also a safe alternative for people who may not have the physical capacity or the physician clearance to engage in normal aerobic activity. So you can relax in the infrared sauna and still receive cardiovascular tone that actually builds over time by spending time just relaxing in the healing heat of the infrared sauna waves. This cardiovascular tone is critical to every single one of our health and well being for a lot of ways. And in other videos, I'm going to be teaching you about pain management and depression, how the cardiovascular system is so critical for helping to mitigate those issues as well. So resilience is what I want you to hold on to more than anything and understand that stress negatively impacts resilience environmental toxins negatively impact resilience and chronic inflammation definitely impacts your capacity for resilience. So by spending 30 minutes in the sauna once a week, once every other week, however you can get it in is going to be providing you clinical stress relief. It's going to be providing you clinical detoxification is going to be enhancing your general adaptability and resilience. It's going to be strengthening and tonifying all of the major systems of your body in a way where you can feel relaxed. I know that we all are needing that and we all want that. <laughs> all of these things work together to help enhance your metabolism. So I hope you will consider talking with me more about how the infrared sauna can support you on an individual basis. Please consider our infrared sauna services at A Step to Health. I'm Crystal. You'll be working with me directly so that we can make sure that you can maximize the clinical benefit and the relaxation that comes from using the infrared sauna. You can contact me using the information below and I look forward to helping you feel better. Thank you.